All right, so <clears throat> I'm gonna do just a quick video about the having how to have like running water while you're living in your vehicle. This is gonna be like two minute video or something. So basically, all you do is you buy one of these. It's I think it's actually made to spray chemicals on the lawn. I got it's made by Scotts. The one I got, I got it at Home Depot. I think it costed it wasn't expensive, maybe twenty bucks. So. Uh, I just dumped this in there <clears throat> on top of the water that was already in there. Then you screw, you know, basically, real quick, you dump the water in there. You put this thing back on. You screw it on. And then you pump the handle. I usually do about 20 pumps. You don't want to over pump it. It's just going to be shooting water out like a fire hose. But yeah, that's basically it. Um, now the nozzle, it comes with like a, a foot long nozzle that I just screwed off the front. And so I just leave it like this. And once it's pumped, you just press down the green thing and you got running water. And another thing is the way I keep this thing from falling over every time I make a turn is I've got this little bungee cord that I run it I run it through the handle and on this side it's just attached to my other cords so that goes there and that keeps this from falling over when I'm driving um, before I did that, it's like every time I made a turn, I, I hit the thing would fall over, and it's frustr it's frustrating when you drive when you're driving to have this thing clattering around and falling over every time you make a turn. All right, so one more thing about the water, and this is the last time I'm filming this shit, bro. I've just filmed this like three or four times. I don't care if I stutter through the whole thing. This is it, bro. So, um. You know, when I was first living in my car, I was going to get, uh, like, a road shower. It's basically, it's a, it's a black pipe that sits on the roof of your vehicle. It's, I think they hold, like, four gallons of water. Um, so I was going to get one of those. Then I realized how expensive they are. They're like, it, they charge a ridiculous amount for them things. So then I looked up how to make one. And it's not that hard to make. You, you can make it. But what I realized is that this sprayer is it's basically a road shower i mean the only difference is it doesn't hold as much water but if i wanted to hold four gallons of water i could just buy four gallons of water and put them in the back of my truck so i don't need it on my on the roof of my car but i the other thing is i don't need to stockpile four gallons of water because i'm in like clear water tampa st pete it's not like i i'm in the middle of nowhere in the middle of the desert where i gotta you know where i need a, st a stockpile of water to keep me alive or nothing i can get water whenever i feel like it i got there's water fountains everywhere. there's water everywhere i'm in florida you know so i mean the way i take showers is i just go to the gym i'm not about to be in the park getting naked and taking showers i'm not trying to draw that kind of attention to myself so you know unless you're going out in the middle of nowhere in the middle of nowhere i would say don't get one of those road showers get one of these sprayers because it is basically a road shower and if you want it to be hot put it up on the roof of your car and let the sun heat it up and it'll it'll get hot i've had that water get hot just from sitting in my truck the other thing is if if that water is not flowing on a regular basis it's going to get stagnant so I, I i don't know much about those road showers but i have a feeling that when you leave that water sitting in that pipe heating up every day it turns nasty like you're not going to want to shower in it you're not going to want to drink it you're not going to want to do nothing except dump it that's my guess i don't know so if anyone's got a road shower let me know if that water stays fresh and you, you know it's not running and it stays fresh then maybe maybe it is worth having maybe i'll even get one at some point but i don't i don't need one now i, don't, I definitely don't need to waste the money on it I don't need to waste the energy building one. I've got one that I got for like 20 bucks. You know what I'm saying? So, I guess that's about it. Well, see you on the next one.